frog's car when he broke down. <laughs> he got towed. I like him big. I like him chunky. I like him big. Welcome to the ultimate alphabet law challenge. Today we're finding out who's the best letter of all time. So if you enjoy this movie, smack that like button. Subscribe if you're new. It's free. And I'm yellow. So today, letters from Alphabet Law will be racing in groups of five to the finish line. And whoever comes last gets removed and replaced by another letter until we have a winner. So let me let the letters introduce themselves. And? And in the third lane. The fourth. And on the outside of the track. And before we start, place your bets in the comments who you think will be the fastest. My money's on N, but there are some spooky boys that will get to race too. And some extras. But now for our first race. Three, two, one. And they're off. Has anyone taken an immediate lead? It's close for now. A, I think A has taken the lead. A has crossed the line. Then B, then D, then C. And E was last. And so that means E is getting replaced by... And we simply race again. Three, two, one. And they're off. Will A take another lead? F looks like he's just stuck behind D. C's in the lead this time. Then B, then D, then A, then F. I think F was just a butt behind. Truly unfortunate. This F stop, stop picking D up and using him as a weapon. And so that means F gets replaced by... Three, two, one. And they're off to the races again. A, will you win this one? A, yes, he's gone in the front. Then B, then G, then C, and D was last. Oh, they formed a cab. Nice. And because D was last, he's been replaced by... Spooky boy, A, B, C, H, G. And they're off to the races. Has anyone taken a lead? Yeah, it's hard to say. I think C has taken the lead. Then B, A, and... Oh, that was too close. It's almost too close to call, but because G is behind H, it kind of makes me think he was probably last. And so that means G gets replaced by... I see you there. I'll see you at the finish line. Good luck, fellas. Is C gonna win this one again? Oh, it's close. It gets close until it gets to the end. I think A is last. No, I! You sabotaged yourself, you fool. <laughs> what were you thinking? A got so lucky. And so I gets replaced by... Okay. He's got a butt. Will it help him? Shabbage. Get him. They're off. J is looking good. Excellent sock form. Yeah, it's looking decent. C's taking the lead. A and B. B is the last across the line. Line. And so B, after so many races, is replaced by <laughs> Flappy Little Insect K. I can't believe A and C are still in this. And they're off racing again. K's looking good. Excellent form. And J's just been yeeted to the back. And who's the last across the line? It was J. Oh, no. And so that means J gets replaced by... <laughs> He's too cool for this. But is he speedy? Let's find out. Oh, he looks decent. He's got some actual excellent form. A and C are doing well. Although L, L was last. Oh, just beaten by A. And so L gets replaced by... Big beefy M. He's looking ready. But is he? Oh, he's looking serious. Dead serious. He's running down. Will he take the lead? I think he's won it. He's won the race. H. H is last. No. He was doing so well. And so that means H gets replaced by my favorite. I think he's going to win. He better because I'm going to look like a fool and do not come last. Whatever you do. Oh, it's so tight. It's so tight. We're zoomed in on the line. And wins. Then M. Then A. And oh. I think C was last by a hair. So that means C gets replaced by... I can't believe A is still in this. Is he going to win the whole thing? There's a decent chance. Look at O's form. It's good form. It's decent. And A is going to win another race. And that means M is last. So M gets replaced by P. And our next race begins. P is looking quick. But, oh no, she's, I think she's been hit to the back. Who's it going to be? N across the line, then K, then A, then O, and P was last. So that means P gets replaced by... Oh, please win. I take it back. I don't want N to win. I want Q to win. Three, two, one. And they're off to the... Ra Q! No! Oh, no! Oh, it doesn't even matter who wins. We'll check anyway. N, then A, then O, then K. I Q. Q. <laughs> I think he's out, lads. No. Oh, poor fella. So that means Q gets replaced by a pirate's favorite letter, Anchor. And they're off to the races. R is incredibly strong. Surprisingly so. It's close. K's taking a lead. And K's across the line. Then N, then O. A's. No. A was last across the line. He's finally out. One of the favorites removed. And so that means A gets replaced by... 
a Slytherin snake, Knorr's, and they're racing. S is looking quick. Everyone's looking good. S is taking the lead. <gasps> no, N, N, no. Wait, the back of that race actually spelt no. My favorite is L. So that means N gets replaced by <laughs> the tallest letter there is. Scr. Circuit? And they're racing. T's looking good. Excellent form. But S, he's just, he's a speedy little snake. Look at him. He's won again. And T, no. He only just got here. So T gets replaced by you, Circu. And they're racing. Will S win his third race in a row? No, he's been hit to the back. U is in the lead. Okay. U's across the line. R is last. And so that means our next letter is... Urskov? Yuskov! Sounds like a Russian city. But is V gonna actually survive two rounds? There's a bit of a curse going on. Wait. Oh, then V, then S. <gasps> I think it was U. No! So U gets replaced by... A W. So, well, he's kind of still here, but double. And they're racing. W has two, and O's taking a nice lead. No, W's in the lead. And then V, then O. Then S has just pipped K. So up next is X. Woofersix. And they're off racing. Surely X wins this, right? Uh, I mean, uh-oh. He's always oh, headed to the back. No, S. No, S's tail. It betrayed him. That's a lot of X's. So S gets replaced by... The marshmallow. Everyone looks very serious. It's only a race, fellas. Oh, look at why. It looks like he's in a in a in a beanbag race and doing nicely. First across the line, and V is out. And so V gets replaced by. Are you okay? He seems sleepy, but maybe he's fast. Let's find out. He's just gliding along. Look at him go. Oh, this is gonna be close. Is it gonna be Z? Is it? And he's removed. And so of all the regular letters, these are the final four. Whoever wins this race wins overall. And we'll get to run in the final race of today against the winner of the curse letters and the extras. So it's all to play for. My money's on Y. And they're off to the races. Y is looking in great shape. X is looking very serious. Oh, this could be a photo finish. W takes it. No way. Was there ever a more fitting winner than W? He literally took the W. Or she? Or they? Oh, there's two of them. What? What just happened? <laughs> Who killed me? And so now we have the race of the cursed letters. At least the ones we have so far, which is just six. So whoever wins this race goes to the winner's race against W. And so in three, two, one, they're off racing. C's rolling down the track. It's hard to say who's winning. It might be E. It's going to be close. I think E's taking it. E, then F, then A, then B, then D, then C. So now it's the turn of the super letters. Plus F, minus X, because he's already won. Three, two, one. And they're off. F is flying. Holy moly. F for flying. And then N. Then what? M just yeeted himself across the line. P was last. What just happened? So P has been removed and replaced by the gun. <laughs> I don't know how it'll do, but let's find out. And they're off racing. Of course, F has just flown down the track. Then M. Is he going to do his weird jump thing? Uh, there it is. <laughs> Nicely done. Then L. Then the gun. O was last. So O's been replaced by the cab. I have a feeling that thing is going to be kind of fast. But only one way to find out. There it goes. Oh, it's taken a nice second place. We know F's going to win. But who's going to be last? No, not N. Not N. M's just yeeted and N was last. And so N has been replaced by the van. Will it be faster than the cab? Let's find out. Taking a nice start. Okay, the van is flying. And second across the line. Then the cab. Oh, and M just behind. Then L beat the gun. So here's our final race. Of course, we couldn't really race with this fella because, well, uh, not only is he massive, but he just murders everyone. So whoever wins this gets to go to the winner's final. I think we know who's winning this. And they're off. F has taken the immense lead. He always does. Already across the line. Then the van. Then the cab. Then M and then L. So here are your three winners where we find out the deciding winner. And it spells few. And few letters are this fast. So start your engines in three, two, one. And they're off. Oh, they're fighting. Oh, no, this always happens. Hang on. Uh, I'll fix it. Now we should be ready to race. Three, two, one, go. And F, of course, has smashed it. And W looks like W's beating E. Nice. So in first place, F with all the gems. Regular W in second. And cursed E in third. So if you've enjoyed this video and you want to see more races, smash that like button and subscribe if you're new. It's free. And I'm yellow.
So here's how it's going to work. We're going to have 1v1 battles. Winner stays on. And then we'll find out which of the letters from the regular alphabet is the strongest. And then we'll do a separate challenge for the extras. Some of the super letters. Some of the combinations. But first we begin with A. It's your boy. And he's fighting B. A sounds a lot more confident, but will he win? There's only one way to find out. They're immediately going at each other. A's kicked him in the teeth. B doesn't really have any legs or arms. He's just fighting. But will it be enough? Oh no, it wasn't. A is our first winner. He moves on to round two. And of course, for every round, we get a fresh creature. He's back with all his health. And his next opponent, you guessed it. C. C. Can A make it two for two? Let's find out. Again, C, no arms, no legs, just biting. He's getting kicked and sent back, which means I think A is getting more hits in. C is a big lad though. A lot of teeth. Oh, but A won again. Look at him. He's so cool. Now, can A make it three for three against D? Half a P. Let's find out. Do you think A is just going to win this whole thing? Let me know in the comments which letter you think is going to win. Don't go cheating. They're having a good battle. D is using a massive head, but is it going to be enough? A, look at it. He's just the coolest dude around. Oh my God. He's dead. He's, uh, I spoke too soon. D moves on. So we got a fresh D against the fifth letter of the alphabet. E. Two very peculiar looking fellas. Mortal enemies, however. And E is using that giant, is that hair? Can we call that hair the thing on the top? Or is it his forehead? D is kind of just a, a, a half a face. And E is one. Are they progressively getting stronger? So up next, our fresh E has to fight F. Now, look at them teeths. Them are human teeth. A lot of molars. They're <laughs> canine. Will F win? Let's find out. Oh my God, he's picked him up immediately. He's using D. Don't know where he got D from, but he's using D as a weapon. A lot of head button, a lot of biting. He's picked him up again. He's chewing on him. No, come on E, you've got this. D's back. Oh, and F wins. He's just a superior letter. So we've got a fresh, and he's in the sand. And his next opponent, G. G has a trunk. Would you, would you look at that thing? Gross. But will that trunk help him in a fight? F has picked him up and is bashing him. G does a weird little, like, sort of a front flip. He hits him with his, is that his butt or his leg? He spins that thing all the way around. He's been picked up again. G's getting a lot of hits in, but I have a feeling F's going to win again. He's out. Oh, and he killed him with the D. F progresses to the next round against H. Spooky, scary Scarfington. Will he win? Willy Winky. Oh, he's kicking him. Look at oh, look at those legs. Oh, he got legs for days. He should be a model. Oh, no. F, put him down. Come on, H, you can do this. He's perhaps one of the weirdest letters there is, but maybe he's incredibly strong. You never know. Uh, no, he, he did. F wins again for our next. It's F versus I. You see what I did there? F, I is, has a gun. Look, he's shooting him with balls. Okay, that's the first weapon we've seen so far. Hopefully it's enough to defeat F. Oh my, what just happened? Look at I, he's so flexible. Look at them backflips. And then he hits him with it with his head. Looking like Clippy. Oh, but he's dead. Oh no, just like Clippy, he's gone forever. Up next is one of the ugliest letters there is. Okay. He's got a butt. Uh, will it help him? Also, he's given me the eye. I'm feeling flirted with. F, please kill it. Kill it with fire or with your teeth, that's fine. He's shaking it like a dog with a chew toy. Or a dog with a sock. J kind of does look like a sock. That reminds me, I need to text Dobby back. Will F, will, he's, he, look at him hitting him with his butt. Oh, it's so gross, J. You're, you're just really weird looking. J for justice or, j or just dead. He's dead. F wins again. Another change of scenery for F. We're by the water and his next opponent is... <laughs> The Wheezy K. Don't be fooled. He's not an insect. He's a yellow letter. And that makes him incredibly strong. Look at him. He hits him with his legs. He's got the pinch moves. He's even got a bite. And F. Oh, he's only just picked him up and shook him around. F is a fierce creature. But is he going to be able to defeat all of the letters? Oh, well. K is dead. Uh, is it? Oh, you, you ripped his beak off? F. Surely he doesn't stand a chance again. <laughs> No, get him, sick him, get him out. Oh no, immediately picked up and thrown around. Come on, Al, use that weird little leg you've got. The, the, the thing? Is it his leg or his butt? Have we figured that out yet? Oh, look at the size of the mouth on the dude. That's a, that's a chomp and a half, but he has no teeth at the top. So would that even hurt? I don't know. Ask your grandma. <laughs> um, come on, Al, kill him. Don't, don't be Al for loser. Oh, you are, you are Al for loser. Get, get in the seat. F's next opponent is... 
Damn. Have we decided if this is his butt yet? Well, if he wins this, he, he can win a, another butt. But maybe he doesn't want it. But he's getting one. He, oh, he's kicking him. He's kick M is very strong. Do not be fooled. He's being thrown around a little bit. The, the double throw. A triple. Now he's being hit by D. Come on, M. You're a big, beefy boy. D's back. M's, M's in his mat. M was in there with D for a second. F is going to town. M is dead. No. Where is that his butt? Oi, 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 oi. Now, if anyone can defeat F, it's gotta be. Yeah, yeah look at it. Look at his nose. Oh, he's just so cool. Wish he was my dad. <laughs> anyway, get, get in there, and Teach him a lesson, F, please. Oh, he did a thing. He did a thing, a little super move. That's a little shockwave. Come on, N, you've got this, lad. Please. No, put him down, F. Don't hit him with the D. He's hit him with the nose, that's it. The nose attack is what... What does the powerful booms? Come on, in. I believe in you, sir. Someone teach F a lesson. He needs to go back to school. Oh, no, he did. Are those your teeth? And your... Oh, God. Uh, where are you going? Well, N's best friend is O. And O is going to teach F a lesson. Are you still saying your name? What? Why does it take you so long to say your name? Get him. Come on, O. Do the thing. Do a big old splish splash. Oh, he's got it as well. He's got the moves. We'll call him Jagger. He's doing it for N. It just kind of looks like F's eating a donut at times. But that's one of the deadliest donuts you'll ever eat. Oh my god, he was- No way. Oh my goodness. Turn around and look at me, you handsome devil. We've got a new king. Give him a crown. And the king gets to fight on the hill. But unfortunately, he's got to fight one of his best friends. P. Oh, would you look at them looking so cool on the here? Will either of them get knocked into the water? Let's find out. Immediate booms. Can't tell who's booming. P's dead. Two shot. Oh, what? Oh, no. P. Don't think you got it easy, yo. Because now you have have to fight. Q, everyone's favorite slug. Come on, Q. Everyone's hoping you win this, lad. Please do it for me. No, <laughs> he actually won. Are you joking? Why? Why is he so strong? What a legend. Why does it look like he's wearing little helmets on his eyes? What a dude. But now he has to fight a surprisingly strong letter. I don't know why he's so strong, but is he as strong as Q? Let the battle commence. Come on, Q, you've got this. He is a fresh Q, by the way. And he's won again. Are you joking? Look at the booty on this. Oh, hello. Up next, we're going to have an underwater battle. Q versus... S is a sea snake. Let's see who win. S is very strong. Do not be fooled. But Q's hitting him with that magic attack. Three shot him. The snake is dead. Why am I craving gummy worms? Q, where are you going? We're staying underwater for our next fight because we've got... Who's a hammerhead shark? Almost, kind of. Not really, but we'll call him that. Who will win? These two are definitely friends in real life. But, you know, Q, he, he has to win. He's heard about the prize money, which is a new butt. And who doesn't want a new butt? Our next fight is in a dark tunnel. And it's against you. Who's going to take the biscuit? You is surprisingly strong. He's just ran away. You. Where are you going, man? You fool. Look at his mouth. Oh, he's come back. He's come back for war. Q's hitting him with the big moves. And he's down. Oh, my. Man. There he goes. There's our king. <laughs> Up next is pointy you. It's V. V for victory. But whose victory will it be? Surely it's Q's. Whoa. V just 360 would him. Who's all of those? Oh. <laughs> uh, Q? Uh, I think he's dead, mate. Q, relax. Relax, fam. Oh my god. He's a savage. Uh, v, are you okay? Uh, someone call an ambulance or the morgue. Well, one V wasn't enough. But what about W? Well, is that technically two U's? But that looks like two V's to me. Can the twins win? It's 2v1? Surely not, right? It's Owen's beating Q. The 360, though, it's good moves. But Patrick Star is dead. Q moves on again. But this is where things start to get spicy. X. He has one of the crystal gems. Will it give him enough? power to beat Q. Let's find out. He's a double ninja, and he's going two-footed. Two-footed. Oh, no. He's, oh, he's cloned himself. Q. Uh, they seem to have turned on each other. They're fighting over there. Q's still fighting someone, but is it a clone? No. Q X died, but X died second. Q definitely died first. Q. X wins. But now X has to fight. Why? Why? Don't ask why. Just fight, you big marshmallow. It's kind of a battle of the marshmallows. Come on, Y. You've got this. Although, up. Uh, X has cloned himself, but will the clones kill X before... Uh, no, Y's dead. They, they seem to be beating each other up. They're just desperate to fight, and, and he's dead. But uh, Y definitely died first. I can stay at this. Which leaves only the letter Z. Regular tiny Z. And his tiny mountain. Will X be the winner of all the regular letters? We're about
about to find out. He's gone in, kicking, cloning. They turned on themselves, but will Z get away with it? Surely not, right? He's getting a uh, 5v1, but he's still alive. No, he's dead. And of course, naturally, X turns on himself and dies. <laughs> but that's definitely a bug we're going to get fixed. So there you have it. The strongest letter in the regular alphabet is X. But honorable mentions go to Q and definitely F. But now for the extras. We begin with Super L versus Super M. The battle has commenced. L's being yeeted back. And he's... Oh, he's dead immediately. Alrighty, look at that hair. Didn't save you, did it? Up next is N, who has even cooler hair. But is he the heir to the, the throne of letters? <laughs> Uh, no, he's dead. Oh my, M, you almost killed me, mate. Are you okay? I think he's fine. Up next is, oh, what a handsome muscular devil. But will those muscles be enough? Well, probably not, because M has them too. M's been poisoned. He's doing the thing. He kicked him in the face and he's dead. Now it's the turn of P. MVP, see what I did there? <laughs> Look at M's hair. He's so cool. But P is cool and also dead. Uh, that didn't last very long. M, where you going? But now M has to fight F, but he has all of the punctuation, making him stronger. It's Super F. Surely, surely M doesn't win this. Oh, he's been chewed in. He's been bitten. At... Wait, I looked away for a second and F died. What? Uh, M, you're a little OP, sir, and your butt looks a little pointier than I remember. But it's not over yet. You haven't won yet, sir, because now you have to fight the cab. C-A-B, three letters. As he does damage, the letters will come out of the cab and then he'll have to fight them as well. There it is. He's killed A. B and C are still alive. He's yeeted in. He's killed them both. He meteor strike them. Up next is G-U-N for gun. Will he win again? Let's find out immediately in. And gun is dead. Where are the letters? He just, he, uh, he didn't even give him a chance to spawn. And then finally the van. It has four letters inside and one of them's regular M. So he'll have to kill himself if he wants to win. But let's see if he'll do it. G's out, U's out. M and N are out. It's 4v1. Come on, lads, you've got this. He's gone in. Uh, G's dead, N's dead, U's dead, MVM and Super M wins. Which leaves only one letter. Better. The Titan. The big Z Titan. Surely he doesn't win this, right? Uh, the battle commenced. He's gone in and he's been murdered by these uh, spikes. Uh, yeah, no, he's dead. He's, <laughs> he's very dead. Not even close. So the Z Titan is your winner for the extras. But just in case you were curious, what about the strongest from the regular alphabet versus him? Will he do better? Probably not. No, we've been sent to space. Oh my God, look at the rocks. Oh, oh Lord. Oh God my head. Oh, send help. I keep dying. Bye. Okay. I think it's over. Is it safe to come out? Well, now you know who's the strongest from Alphabet Lore. If you've enjoyed this video, smack that like button and subscribe if you're new. It's free. And I'm yellow. And so today we've come back to the ultimate staircase to see who can go the highest. Not only do we have the regular alphabet, we have some cursed letters, some super letters, and some baby letters. And we shall begin with the first half of the regular alphabet, starting with A. A, get up. Once he hits the bottom of the staircase, he shall leave. Leap up and it's not a bad start. Maybe B is better? Uh, I think, is he gonna make it? No! Let's see if this one can. Uh, I'm sorry. This one has made it. We've already got a clear winner. But there's plenty more letters to go. Up next is D. How's the height? It's nice. It's good. Is it enough? He's on the step with C. Up next is the letter E for easy peasy. Let me up this staircase. Oh my goodness. Hang on. Hang on. Oh, he's done it. Easy. What? I told you it'd be easy. That was easy. Up next is F. And surely F will do better? Not really. I mean, it's kind of the second best jump, but he's on this stair with D and C. Can G get up there with E? I don't know, but maybe. No, oh no, not even close. G, G, G. Up next is H. Look at him, look at him wobbling. Now watch him jump. How's the height? Is it enough? Oh, it's not bad, but it ain't enough. Have we spat any words yet? Not yet, we'll keep working on it. Up next is I. I see him doing very poorly, and I was right. Oh, same as G. Igba? Up next is J. J. How is this jump? It's a good J, J for jumping jack. Oh, he's tied with E. J. Up next is K, who's almost got wings. So can he go high? Howdy, howdy high. Good flappage. I like it, but it ain't enough. He's with H. Up next is L. Will he take an L or will he take a double? He's taking an L, lads. He's, oh, it's a big fat L. Holy moly. 
Leg, Ligma. It's almost Ligma. Oh, we need to get the M up there. M, please, please, you can do this. You, you go to that step. Oh my gosh, he's done it. No, he's not. He's gone too far. He's gone incredibly far. M, M, he's made it up. Up by the skin of his M. M J E. M J any of the top for this batch. Ligma at the bottom. And so here's the second half of the regular alphabet from N to Z. And we begin with N. My favorite. How's his jump? Is it nice and high? N for nice. N for not that great. Up next is O. He doesn't seem keen. He seems a little tired. But that's fine. <laughs> he doesn't have a say in it. That's the worst one we've seen by a mile. Oh, my. P? O, P. Will this be O, P? No. It is O, P. <laughs> oh, wow. That's terrible. Or is it Po? Po? Who? Anywho, up next is Q. Now, I'm not sure. Q is, uh, of, of course, incredibly slow. We know this. But how high is his jump? It's nice and high. But again, the momentum is not quite there. He's He may be down here by himself. Oh, no. I feel kind of bad. But the show must go on. Up next is R. And how high is it? It seems like... Is he going to make it to that step? Oh, I thought he was going to bounce off E, but he didn't even get that high. So up next is S. The Slytherin Snake. And oh, my goodness. This might be the best one we've seen. Oh, no, it's tied. M, J, S, and E. So up next is T. T. The hammerhead shark. He's a bit of a fish out of water. The butt, nice wiggle to it, but not high enough. Up next is U. Not you, silly. The letter. And the jump is... Unspecial. Kahut Riftikin. Close to a word. Ligba. Poo <laughs> cue. Up next is me. And how's this jump? Good spread form. Oh my gosh, this, this is actually very decent. It's, it's the best we've seen. What about two Vs? Uh, technically, it's two Us. D w. Ow. Oh, there's two of them, so they're really heavy. Oh, they bounced off of I. They've ruined Ligma. Lugma? You know what? We'll take it. Up next is X. Everyone's favorite ninja with two headbands. How's the jump? It's surprising. Surprisingly not great. I'd hoped for more. Up next is Y, the pillow. Or marshmallow, depending on how hungry you are. Ah, the jump is just not great. Liwigma? Li Liwigma? So that leaves only Z. But he does have a mountain on his head, so maybe that'll slow him down. Let's find out. How's the jump? It's... Oh, it's not great. It's the same as L. Hi, L. You guys are a little close. And so from the regular alphabet, last place, of course, is Q. And we have five on the top step. M, J, V, S, and E. So up next, we've got the first six letters of the alphabet that have been turned into cursed monsters. And A gets to go first. A, will he be better than his regular self? His regular self's all the way down there. He's done incredibly well. The best so far. But what about B? Unfortunately for B, he has a beak and a broken leg. But maybe he can jump? I don't know. Oh, it's decent. Is it? Is he gonna? No, behind T. Up next is C, and C has the power of rolling. How be the rolling? The rolling be decent. Is it enough? to get to that step so close best so far up next is d he's got legs and he looks like a donut d for don't almost second best of the cursed up next is e cursed e. he's coming in blood looks like a demon will he make it oh my gosh hang on hang on wait for it wait no so close and so finally cursed f surely he has the highest oh oh my goodness oh it's very high will the momentum take him onto the he skipped a whole step are you joking look at him look how high he is from the other ones that's gonna take some beating but up next we've got the super letters and the combinations and our first creature to yeet is the cab c-a-b how can it jump it's a car is the car is decent it's very nice that's an excellent jump for a car up next is a gun a g-u-n oh it just shot and nearly killed q but lucky you you, Q. Oh, hang on. That's also very good. But what about the van? There's four letters. Maybe it's heavy. Let's find out. How could a van even jump? It makes no sense. But it's the, almost the same as the gun. And then we move on to the super letters, beginning with super L. L for loser or L for... Uh, no, it's loser. It's lo <laughs> Don't worry about it. M for mother? Mummy? Mummy! You've got this. Oh, it's high. Oh, it's good. We finally got one onto this step, but it's not beaten evil F. What about super N? With the fancy quiff. Spanish N. Here he goes. He's, I think he's beaten M, but he's not quite beaten F. Okay, it's your turn. You, oh, wiggle that butt. Uh, I think he hit the step. Oh, wiggle that butt. Here he goes. Oh my goodness, that would, that could have been better. That was EO. EO, EO doc. Up next is Super P. Look how strong that leg is. She got only one, but it might be enough. Ah, uh, it's not. Yop. And so that leaves Super F. 
Can Super F go as high as Cursed F? Only one way to find out. The yeet is poor. That is shocking. What happened, lad? That wasn't very high at all. That's cursed. Say fire truck. Fire f so here's how it stands currently, and we're left with just the babies. Look at them. It's so adorable. And of course, we begin with the cutest of the lot. It's baby A. I don't even know how these babies jump, but I have a feeling it's going to be decent. It's, oh, just squeezed off. Little tadpole tails hanging off the edge. Can B do better? Bonanza. Banana? Boob. It's a little bit better. What about C? Only got one tooth, but looks furious. Spinning sideways, and the jump is nice it's nice but it ain't nice enough but it was the highest of the babies so far so d you're up next looks like a p with a haircut look at that thing flop and there it goes the jump hang on oh my goodness baby d up, up with the supers now the turn of baby e he looks too cool he's too cool to jump how is the oh he's so slow it's high but i think he's oh no he's down here with these fools you you suck which leaves only baby f look at him he looks so keen and we're climbing inside and we're gonna yeet in three two one he's off how's the jump it's not very high the speed was nice but it just wow there's three f's on here regular super and baby they all made it there and then we don't see another f until we get right to the top and we have a clear winner of the entire video it's evil f Congratulations, sir. Have a fist bump. And in second place, Spanish N. In third, M. And then the biggest shock of the day, Baby D. How? Some honorable mentions to this shelf. They all did pretty well. Look at this dude. This shelf, well, bit disappointing. You should be upset at yourself. And then we got the even worse shelf. Although it did spell Ligba for a bit, so we'll forgive it. And then we got Poo. And then, of course, in last place, Cool. So there you have it. Now we know who jumps the highest. If you've enjoyed this video and you want to see more like it, smack that like button and subscribe if you're new. <laughs> it's free. And I, yellow. Did you look at all those chickens? And so we begin with the letter B. He's a tough guy. And seeing as he's the first letter of the alphabet, you'd think he'd be pretty fast. But that's what we're here to find out. Look how he walks. Look how he runs. And the jump is good. It's high. But is it far? It's not bad. He's made it almost to the little rock. It's a good start. But now, B. Be a good letter and get over that bridge, would you be? And there he goes. Hi. I don't know if he's got it in the bag. He has got it in the bag. He's beaten him. I guess first is the worst. He's even past the little rock. Up next is the letter. He's very keen. C for keen. <laughs> Uh, 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 spelling's hard. Here he goes. He's quite far. He reminds me of a horseshoe sideways. He's beaten A by a tiny little margin. But he didn't win. But now it's time for D. D for don't fall in the river, you fool. Oh, it's not very high. But it's not bad. It's surprisingly. Oh, it's kind of bad. E. There it is. E for he's got teeth. And he's and he goes wibbling and wobbling. And then he's jumping. It's decent, it's high, it's better than D, but no, not great. Up next is everyone's favorite. It's F. He's had a hard life and it may affect his jumping ability. Here he is walking, here he is running. Will his, his jump be F grade? Wait, he's had a buff. His jump has had a buff. It, uh, Previously, we saw him just jump about an inch off the ground, but now he's done quite well. Look at him. He's almost in the lead. B is still just in front. Up next is the letter. Oh, God, he's handsome. Look at that. Look at that lip. Look at his trunk. Oh, can you go in there? Oh, oh, my. By the way, at this point in the video, I want you to go in the comments and pick which letter you think is actually going to win. You've got three seconds. One, two three and now we're g and look at him run look at g go g, g, g for g go get him get him g you got this oh your last mate that is oh god look at him all the way at the back oh no i'm next is one of the spookiest letters he's it, it kind of creeps me out h and he's it, he, he kind of floats a little bit the ghostly look at that face h for haunted i don't know there he goes running jumping oh it's poor that is a poor j that might be the worst one that is the worst one look at him he's not even off the ramp up next is the letter hi hi it's a bit weird a bit creepy but uh, anyway we move on here he is walking here he is running like the pixar lamp oh it's good oh it's actually decent i didn't expect him to get that far to be honest up next is one of my favorites you can probably guess why 
My name begins with it, and he's got a butt, a really serious butt. That's a that's a proper butt. Oh yeah, we're going in. He also looks a bit like a sock. Ah, uh, there he goes jumping. J for jump. Come on, please, no, don't be last. Okay, well, we'll take second from last. It'll, it's not last. It could have been worse. K. Or should I say? Okay. I think this bug smokes. Anyway, here he goes. Look out! Look at those legs. Look at him. And look at look how he runs. He pinches the K together. No! Oh my gosh! The flap. Oh, it's good. Oh, it's a very good jump. Oh, the flappage. The flappage. But no! Oh, he bounced off of F and into second place. Currently, BKF are your leaders. But now it's the turn of. Ew. He's very serious. I think he's trying to sound sexy. I don't know if it's working. Look how he runs. It's really weird. And the jump. Oh, the jump's good. Oh my gosh. Have we got a new leader? It's gonna be. Oh, he's done it. He's only gone and done it. Look at him. He's taking the lead. Now it's LBK. But could the lead be snatched by? Um. He's a very serious dude. He's got big, chunky legs. Good for jumping. We're in. We're walking. We're running. Uh, he's not actually that fast. But maybe the jump will make up for it. That is an excellent jump right at the end of the ramp. Uh, no. No, he's just beaten F into fourth place. Up next is perhaps my favorite letter. He just has the best voice. He's so weird. Oh, we're going to walk him up to the ramp. Now we're going to run him. And the heat. How is the yeet? The yeet's good. Oh, my goodness. There's no way. Come on. Come on, Ed. Oh, he bounced off K, and he's kissing L. I need a close-up of this. He's breathing down his neck. Oh, my goodness. But he hasn't beaten him. He's got a solid second place. Up next is the letter. Okay, let's get him up that ramp. There he is running back. Well, he sort of uh, hops. Oh, God, that's not great. Oh, no, he hasn't made it. At least he's not in the water. But Oh, that was terrible. Up next is Adorable, if not a little weird. And here she is walking, uh, hopping, running, jumping. Come on, P, you've got this. That is P, that is shocking. P, guys, what's going on? Oh, I don't think it's going to get much better. Because up next, look at your. Right, let's get inside him. Oh, I've always wanted to be cute. Oh, look how slow he walks. What about his run? Oh, okay. The run's a little better. This is, um. 2,000 years later. And he's at the top of the ramp. And the, oh, the jump. Surprisingly good. He looks like garlic. But he's... Oh, he's on the he's on the ship. Q is the captain now. All aboard. Up next is... Oh, he's a happy fella. Can, can, he's got two legs. That's good for jumping. How will he fit? He's not the quickest. But oh, it's good. That is a solid jump. We haven't seen one like this for a while. And he's... No way. He's taken a massive lead. How... Ah. Oh, really? But can I hold on to it? Because up next is... Yes. He's a creepy snake. He doesn't have legs. Or is he one big leg? Let's find out. Look at him slithering. But he really, he's a Hufflepuff. And look at him go. Hi. Far. Will it be enough? No, but I think it's second place. He's just ahead of L. And up next is... T. I love tea. I'm British. And I also like hammerhead sharks. This is this is the double whammy for me. Look how he runs. Good form. Good. But how's your jump? Oh, last minute jump. He's spinning his butt, but it's not enough. Oh, he bounced off of H. And he secured himself a couple of extra places just behind G. You can just see his eye over the top of D. But up next is... <laughs> Look at that mouth. Oh, pinching. Look at it. Look how we do the thing. What shall we do the... Oh, there. We're like a pair of trousers upside down. You get over the bridge. Get over the bridge. You. Ah, uh, it's not great. But it's not the worst. Middle of the pack. Up next is... V. He's a pointier you. W will the sharpness help him? V for very good jumper, maybe? Oh, the jump's decent. It's high. It's got a nice length to it. And just behind N, which puts him in fifth. Up next is our first pair of twins. W, the creepy twins. They're like the ones from The Shining. Well, we better walk this wobble you up to the bridge and then run it. And uh, it's kind of bouncing along a little weird. I don't have much hope for it. It's too heavy. It's just too big. Just behind T. Up next is X. He's a ninja. Surely he jumps far. X, go give it to him. Here he goes running. Not bad. And jumping. It's okay. Uh... I don't think he's gonna... No. Find A. Middle of the pack. But now, one of my other favorite letters. Why? 
Why? Sorry, I, I got carried away. It looks like a marshmallow. With two marshmallows for eyes, oh, it's just so marshy. There's the walk. <laughs> so good. And the run. All uh, right, uh, uh, it's not bad, but oh, it's not very high, is it? Oh, no. Come on, you can beat H. No. Oh, dear. Feel this back on the ramp. Looking kind of sad back there, you two, H and Y. And so for the final regular letter, it's Z. Or Z. And, and, th and th there's the mountain. And we're going to climb inside. I am now in the universe. We're sliding along. And it slides a little faster. Oh, come on. You've got this. You've got this. Oh, my gosh. No way. Surely. Surely. Oh, it's going to be close. No. It's. Wait. What? It looked like it was going further. Z. No. You let me down. Don't worry. There's more letters to come. However, for the regular alphabet, Q. A firm last, followed by O and P, but our top five, R took the lead by quite a lot. Then S by a, oh, maybe S, I think just by an eyeball. Then L, then N, who's just too close. And then V, who got it right in the comments? But let's go yeet some more letters. So here are our final contestants. Super L, Super M, Super N, Super O, and Super P, as well as the cab and the van. <laughs> We begin with Super L. Surely this is just the furthest jump by a mile, right? You'd think he's super. No. What do you mean it was less than the other one? Okay, Super M. Maybe they're just all muscles. Oh my goodness, relax, dude. You've got this. Yeet over the bridge. Come on, look at that form. Look at it. Oh, he's glorious. But it's, oh, it's worse than the other M too. And he's stacked up. He's, he's, he's sort of just bouncing on top of F. Oh, no. Come on, N. Do not let me down. I believe. Look at your hair. You're fabulous. You've got this. No. no. N. Guys, I'm starting to think muscles just make you heavier. What's going on? Oh. Oh, look at that butt wiggle. Oh, that is great. That's great form. Okay. Oh, this is good. Is it enough to take the... He bounced. He bounced off of L. He's in second place. And P. P. We're going to call her Penelope with the muscular leg. And there she goes. Come on. You've got this. The power of P. Stuck in M. Becoming a bit of a mess over there. All right. Now there's three of them. C, A, and B. A's driving. C is the structure. And B are the wheels. Surely three is better than one. It's not very fast. Oh, but it can jump. Have you ever seen a car that can jump? Now you have. Uh, it bounced off quite a few into a nice third place. Is it cheating? I don't know. And finally, the van. And of course, V, A, and N make up the vehicle. Look at that face. He's so serious. Surely this thing is super fast, right? Look at those eyes. Look at the move. This is just regular speed. Now it's sprinting. Come on, van. You've got this. Oh, hey. I think we've got a winner, lads. The van. There you have it. I guess the, uh, the, the more the merrier. The van has smashed it. I've also just realized I think the cab might have punched O in front of R. It's all gone a bit wrong, hasn't it? Also, here's a spoiler for a future video. Get rid of it. Tune in tomorrow to see what that spoiler's about. But if you've enjoyed this video and you want to see more like it, smack that like button and subscribe if you're new. It's free. <laughs> and I'm yellow. Oh god. Oh god, everyone relax. No. Today we're finding out whether the babies from Alphabet Law are they adorable? Are better than their uppercase parents? Future selves. And we'll begin with a regular one-on-one. -on -one. Whoever jumps the furthest gets a point for their team. Then we shall hack them with a bit of hacking. Then we'll turn them into Lego. And then perhaps we'll change the gravity. But first, let's begin with a regular one-on-one. -on -one. I'm gonna climb inside A's butt, and we're gonna yeet him across the bridge. Here he goes. It's a very nice a very firm jump. Respectable effort. How do baby do? What do baby do? He's got a tail like a tadpole. And that's why we like him. It's, uh, he didn't go very high. Uh, he made it, though. And that's a point for the adults. Up next is B. He used to be, <laughs> well, a little more active and slightly smaller, but still very sad. Regular B gets to yeet first. And he's off. Is he better than A? I don't think he is. If anything, oh, that's worse than baby A. Come on, little fella. You've got this. B gone. Bridge. I think he's done it, lads. I think it's one each. One, one. Up next is... See? And there's the little baby seat. He only had one tooth. He certainly grew a few more. And we'll yeet the regular one over first. And he's off. Is it the furthest we've seen today? I think I remember him being decent. He's beaten A, but not baby B. Little C. Oh my goodness. Look how he... Oh, he seems he seems quick, but the jump barely any height. Shocking. 2-1 to the adults. Up next is... And here's baby D. <laughs> 
Just before he got his outline. Oh, why do they both look constipated? <laughs> anyway, Big D goes first. Delightful jumping. Uh, although, not very high. Just behind B. Come on, little D, you've got this. Come on, little fella, with your floppy head. Oh, it's good. Oh, it's incredible. Look at that mouth go. And up behind C, but that's a point. Two, two. Up next is the letter E. And he seems to have changed his color as he got older a little bit. <laughs> also, I think he's drunk. Anywho, regular E, big ol' E. Easy peasy. Oh, it's very good. That is an excellent jump. That might be the furthest we've seen. And just beaten Baby B. But little E. Ooh, he looks funky from behind. I don't know if I like it. That is not a great jump. Not very high. Shocking. 3-2 to the adults. Which leaves Baby E. Isn't he adorable? I think he might be my favorite. And we're going to yeet regular F over first. And he's got a nice jump. Is it the longest? I think it might be. No, bounce. He bounced off of E to take the lead. Oh, little fella. You can do this. I believe in you. Back before his uh, his whole life changed. Look at that wiggly butt. And uh, no. Oh, no. That's 4-2 to the adults. Not a great start for the babies. So now around, I didn't mention at the beginning, but well, technically these guys can be considered adults. So let's do the babies versus the demons. The curse letters. And I have this special randomizer jump tool just so that the babies, well, they don't do the same jumps they did in round one. You never know. They may go further. They may go shorter. Let's find out. Little a, you can go first with your big wobbly weird head. That is incredible. That's sensational. It's too high though, but he has beaten his previous jump. Now cursed A for the adults with also a wobbly head. Why do they all have wobbly heads? That's a good jump. I think he's beaten a baby. Oh no. That's 5-2 to the adults. Now baby B, he's not a B. He's a wasp. Get him, teeth. Oh, he's hit the roof as well, but it's better. B, B for bet. Wait, is it better? No, it's worse than last time. Cursed B, he's broken. Surely not. Surely he doesn't. Oh no. Oh, it's good. Oh, it's a very good jump. And would he have lost? Oh, he's just bounced off of A. Is it cheating? Technically not. 6-2. Baby C, we'll call him Charlie. Oh, his jump is not as high. Nice bit of momentum. And he's beaten his previous jump. Hey, yeah. Cursed C, your big weird wheel. Get over the bridge. How is it? Spinny. I think he's beaten him. Oh, no. Oh, the babies are having a tough day. 7-2. Baby D, come on, lad. You've got this. Oh, what, did he do this before? The weird wiggle. Oh, and he's just behind him. Himself. Evil D. Kind of looks like a donut. Look at those shiny legs. Anyone else getting hungry? Has he been? <gasps> He's beaten him by like a foot. No. 8-2. Now E. We'll go with baby E first. E for easy win. Oh, that is sensational. He has hit the roof though. Oh no. Joint with A. Cursed E. The fastest of the cursed letters. How's the jump? I think he's got it in the back. Oh, oh it's kind of close. It's 9-2. Come on, little left. You can do this, lad. I believe. Oh, it's nice. I like it. Nice bit of tail action. Decent. Cursed him. Oh, no. Look at his weird splashy bum. Oh, my God. He's hit the roof, though. That means he's lost. He's lost. Yes. 9-3. I think we need to clear the runway for the next round. We get a letter. We climb inside the letter. I am now the letter. I'm going to walk up to this huge skyscraper. We simply jump to the highest point. And when he stops, I will spray his name on the wall. And whichever letter goes the highest wins. Regular A is done. So we can chill on the bench. Our next contestants are... And we're going to yeet them all up and see who goes the furthest. But there's plenty more to go. So while I send B up the building, make sure you vote in the comments who you think is going to go the highest. It's not B. What was that? C, you're up next. C for Caddy. Do oh, he's doing pretty well. Not bad. Not as high as A, though. Up next is D. D. Delightfully poor. That was uh, better than B. But it's not saying much. Up next is E. Easy. Uh, sort of middle of the pack. They've been pretty spread out so far. Look at them. Up next is F. Now, if you think anyone could jump high, it surely would be F, right? Ah, uh, he's in third place. What? Maybe G with the trunk? Go get him. What the devil was that? You're as bad as B. And now H. How will he do? Uh, surprisingly well. I think he's taken... No, A is still in the lead. So after that first batch, we got A, we got H, we got C, and we got F. Our next contestants are... Hi. J. Now, let's see if any of these can beat A. We start with I. 
little fella, but a mighty jump, I think, and it's almost enough. That was close. Perhaps second place, but what about you, Jay, you big sock? Oh, no. What was that? You've let me down. Still like your butt, though. How nice is K? The insect of the letters. And it's poor. It's really poor. Fifth from last. Up next is L. L for loser. Yep, sort of. Not the worst. Not great. Up next is M. He's a big beefy boy and he's not in his super form yet. And it's uh, it's pretty average. N. Look at his schnoz. Send him up. And how is it? Oh, it's oh, it's it's actually quite nice. I think that might be fifth place. Oh, I don't know why. I just get the feeling this is going to be terrible. Oh, and it was. Oh, dear. That's the worst we've seen so far. What about you, P? That's sorry, O. Ah, uh, P. P. With another shocker. I think she tied with O. Po. I think actually O went slightly higher. P. What happened? And it turns out I didn't actually go as high as A. A still winning. So up next we've got. <laughs> Why? And they finished. And we begin with Q. He's not very fast. Uh, if you've ever seen him walk around, he's, I mean, he's kind of a slug. But maybe he jumps high. Let's find out. Q, you ready? Here he goes. Oh my, it's not bad. It's just better than most of them. Oh, Q, you've done yourself proud. One like is one pat on the back. Up next is R. Up next is R and R. Are you seeing this? He's he's just beaten I. I don't think it's enough to beat A, but decent. Very good. The snake is up next. Oh, he just smacked R on the butt. But the leap is... Uh, it's okay. We'll take it. Up next of the troublesome duo, T. Look at his teeth. It looks like a dumb shark. And I like it. And the jump is sensational. He's taking the lead. Ooh, what? Alrighty, up next is you. You won't believe your eyes when you see him jump because it's rubbish. V for very poor indeed. Oh, what about W? There's two of them. Gotta be good, right? Oh, he banged its head. We, we go again. Jump! Oh, stop doing that. This time for sure. There it is. Oh, it's okay. It's not bad. We'll take it. Oh, this is a weird angle. X is up next. X! Oh, X, you, you really disappoint. I always have big hopes for this lad. Anyway, we'll move on to the pillow. Anyone else craving marshmallows? Ah, uh, it's not great. I'd hope for more. That's such a tall letter, but what about Z or Z? He slides and his jump is poor. It's uh, it's not great. And so here's the results of the full regular alphabet. As you can see, there's quite the spread with P and O right at the bottom. And then at the top, T is just one story above A. But it's not over yet, because up next we got the babies. And so far we only have six of them, but we're going to see if any of them can jump the highest. Starting with baby A. And it's, it's not bad. Not bad for a baby. Still not great. Maybe B's better? B for better. Uh, it was better. Just a little bit. What about you, C, with your tooth? The most adorable of all the letters, and it's very poor. Lowercase d. What about you, E, you sassy fella? Get up the wall. That is terrible. What were you thinking? Now, baby F. And my hopes sort of lie with this baby. He's an incredible... What? Am I watching F? If we were in school, you'd get an F. Babies, you're rubbish. But in case you were wondering, baby B did jump the highest, then A, then D, then E, and then F. Next, we've got some cursed letters. A oh boy, are they cursed. And we're starting with cursed A. Regular A did really well, but how about the cursed one? Oh my goodness, I think we got a new record, lads, by an absolute mile. Cursed A takes the lead. What about cursed B? Are they all gonna shoot right up the building? I think they might, and B, I said it's just tied or maybe even beaten A. C? Is it bad? Uh, wait, are they all the same? D? Break the pattern, D. You haven't. That's the same again. D? Well, I told you they were cursed. Even their jumps. <laughs> they're all, they're all cursed. Now, if anyone jumps differently, yep, it's all. Um, I think maybe if he was further back, he might have cleared the whole building. Yep, he did. Okay, well, we'll just leave him up here to look down on everyone. Curse G, got anything different in there, lad? Oh, it's not great. Okay, things are changing. H, what about you? Oh, my goodness. We'll take it. It's strong. I? I can't believe he's done this. Oh, it's not great. J, look at his butt. The jump from J is, uh... Lower than F, but F's technically on the roof. K, with a weird foot, and oh, 
hit the hit the ceiling, which means we're gonna give K another chance further back where F was and see if it gets on top. It did. These two are both up here. L, you wanna go from back here? <laughs> He's done it as well. Well. Some of the cursed letters are certainly OP. But up next, we've got the super letters, including F with all the gems, as well as the combinations cab, van, and gun. Now, let's see how they compare. Super F, you're up first. Get up that building. That is dreadful. What? Oh, he's climbed himself. Dude, relax. Alrighty, up next is Super L. Will he change the L from loser to lad? No, he's... <laughs> M for Mary. Do it for Mary. Who is who's Mary? That is not great. Better than Super L, but Super N. Spanish N, you've got this. What is going on? When? All right, Super O, use those muscles, you big beefy boy. Okay, it's decent. It's higher than a lot of the curse letters. Very nice. P, stop moving around and get up the building. <laughs> no. It's not great. And what about the cab? I mean, have you ever seen a, a cab jump? Now nah, you have. Uh, but three letters, you've sort of let me down. Van? Van, you do it. N not really. Middle of the pack. And finally, the gun. Gun! <laughs> Oh dear. And so if you remove the curse letters, Super O is actually the highest jumper from the regular alphabet law. There he is, your king. Unless you want to crown these fellas, let me know in the comments. And I know what you're thinking, what about Titan Z? Well, he's halfway up the skyscraper already, but we'll give him a go, I'm climbing in. Oh, he's just killed some. All right, we're gonna go from this side so he doesn't kill anymore. Titan Z with the jump. And, uh, did he, uh, uh, he marked it. He, he, he got a spray off. Where is it? It's, it's in the sky somewhere. Is it the roof? No, he's not quite. But it was enough to beat Super O. Though technically the Titan's the highest. It seems unfair though. Baby F. But if you've enjoyed this video and you want to see more like it, smack that like button and subscribe if you're new. <laughs> it's free. And I'm... Yellow! See, we're back at the bridge, and Jerry's been hacking again. What the dog doing? And he's given us another anti-gravity block. Well, it's not anti-gravity. It basically just switches the gravity every 10 seconds. So you never know how far something will jump. Let me show you. A, you can go first, lad. Get up that ramp. And the gravity seat. Oh, it's heavy. Oh, it's gone in. Oh, no. Not a great start. Curse you. But now we're going to go through all the letters of alphabet law and find out who has the best luck with gravity. So up next, naturally, is B. And I will spawn them in individually so you can hear their names. <laughs> it just doesn't get old. Come on, lad, you've got this. Be better than A. Oh, no, wait. He's gliding. Oh, he, oh, he almost made it. At least he's not wet. Up next. See Will he see things go well for himself? Oh, gravity's nice and graceful, but will it drop him? He's still going. Oh, and it dropped him finally. He's taken the lead by a mile. Up next, D the P and get yeeting over the bridge. How's the jump? There is not much of a jump, but the glide is even better than C. Will he get dropped? D oh, he's coming down. Oh my gosh, I thought he was going to make it. D just keep going further. Up next is... Can't tell if he's goofy or handsome. But how's his gravity? Oh, nice and graceful. But, oh, it's dropping him quickly. But not too much. And he's in front of C. Up next. Is he evil or misunderstood? Bit of both. And the jump is good, graceful, nice teeth. Who's his dentist? But he's coming down. He's, oh, he bounced off C. He's always taking advantage of him. Up next. Oh, tell me, would you kiss those lips? <laughs> Well, anyway, G for get over the bridge and show me gravity. Oh, G for gravity. That makes more sense. How's he doing? He's still going up. Is he coming down? He came down. A nice second place. Our next contestant is... Spooky boy. He's got six teeth. Six more than your mom. <laughs> oh my god. The jump is good, but the gravity's cruel. H. Oh no. He's not last, but he's at the back. Up next. He seemed too, too keen, sir. Toxic positivity. Here he goes. Get him over the bridge. Nice jump. But if the gravity switches, no. It's, oh, truly unfortunate. Hi. <laughs> Get it? Hi. Up next is the one with the butt. Jay. Jay. He's got a butt. Look at it. I think it's a butt. Or is he just a loose sock? I don't know. Get him over the bridge. Will the jump be nice and firm? It's a glider. Yeah, which usually is a good sign. Glides do well. But is he going to get dropped by gravity? He's still going. J oh, he's going to make it. Are you serious? He's, he's still going. But he's going into the void, lads. Will he ever come down? <laughs> I think he's stuck. No, he's coming down. Well, Jay's certainly taking the lead. And if anyone else makes it to the back, we'll have to have a showdown. Up next is... 
The Wheezy Wasp. Okay, for king of jumping with gravity. Oh, it's nice, but the gravity's mean. At least he's not wet. Our next contestant. Let me climb inside you. Oh, it's good. Oh, it's high. It's glidey. We might have another one for the back. As long as the gravity doesn't change. Uh-oh. Oh, no. It's, he's coming down. He's coming down. Oh, look at him. Up there on that fence. He's so smug. Up next is the master. M for master. A frowning? How's his glidage? It's more of a glide challenge. Oh, it's beautiful. He's taken off like an eagle. Oh, look at that form. Is that his butt on the top? Are those butt cheeks? Oh, the gravity's mean. He's in third place, though. Up next. Mm. My favorite. Mm. It's got four teeth, but really, how many more do you need? And the jump is sensational. Incredible height, but very poor glide. End for not even close. Up next. Oh. You finished? All oh, right, get over the bridge, would you? Yeet. Oh, good glide. Look at that form. Donuty. Oh, with the gravity, though. Jerry, stop turning it off or on. I don't know. Up next. P. P for pretty cool. Poor jump dough. Yep. Hop <laughs> down with A. App pa. Up next, my second favorite letter. It's just adorable. And we'll um we'll be right back after these messages. If you ever have a problem with slugs, put beer in your garden. It'll kill them. And here he is. He's at the, he's at the bridge. <gasps> Wait. Look at his form. He's sensational. Is he going to make it? Please, Gravity. Just let him have this. Let him have this. He needs this. He's never actually made it across before. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, he made it. Like a proud father. Q. You did it, lad. Keep up next. Arr. Are you good enough? He's a very good job. I remember this about him. Nice glide. Will gravity smile upon him? It's doing it a bit so far, but uh-oh. He's coming down behind D. RD. Arrgh. Up next. The Slytherin snake. Everyone's favorite Hufflepuff. Let him get him. Snake him. Nice height. But you, we've seen the ones that jump high tend not to have the best luck with gravity. He's behind O. And I know what you're thinking. So, who's next? <laughs> Every British person's favorite. It's T. Get him over the bridge. Oh, nice form. Nice spinning. But no, he's too heavy. He's at the front of a bad bunch. Up next is... Who are you? I'm a letter from the alphabet and I'm jumping off a bridge. And it's nice. Nice height. Come on, gravity. Change. You've got this. No. Uh, no. Up next is... V for vengeance, because today he's taking the win. He's never won anything in his life. And today's that day. <laughs> is it last? <laughs> oh, God. Viva, very bad. Up next is W, which really looks like double V. Will it have double the success of V? Probably not. Oh, it's better. It's much better. That is incredible height, but oh, no glide. Up next is everyone's favorite ninja. But does he have the power of gravity? Uh, not really. Oh, God, that is shocking. Up next is another one of my favorite letters. Why? I, I don't know. I just think you look like a marshmallow. Don't ask me questions, you big pillow. Now get over the bridge. Oh, good. We haven't seen a glide in a while. Really? Oh, he bounced off of X and sort of did okay. And up next. <laughs> oh, there he is. Or is it a pimple? I don't know. Get him over the bridge. He d How does he even walk? He sort of glides. <gasps> he glides. He's a god. No. <laughs> uh, Z, I think you're a little close, dude. Um, X's bandana kind of looks like Z's tongue. <laughs> it's so weird. So now we've seen all of the regular alphabet. Let's take a look at some of the extras. Starting with Super L. Alpha, lovely. Now get over there. Or Alpha loser. Or look at that booty. Uh, oh, yeah. He glided off a few, but it's not great. Up next is M. M for the master of gravity. Calm down, dude. Relax. You'll get your chance now. Glide. Come on. Get to the back. As much as I like Jay, he needs competition. Oh, oh no. N. Oh, he's so handsome. Body goals. Get him over the bridge. Look at that hair swaying in the wind. The height. Sensational. The glide. Shocking. Super O. God, I could kiss him. But instead, I'm going to throw him off a bridge. Oh, look at him go. Look at it. Okay, well, uh, Super P, she's so muscular in here. Is that her leg or her neck or whatever that is? I don't know. <laughs> Let's not talk about it. What are you doing? Get down from the P. No, stop it. Get back over the bridge. Why is she doing a madness? She's in the P. You know what? We'll get a fresh one. Don't do that again. Now, simply jump over the bridge. Oh, good glide. All you gotta do is make it last. Get to J. How did he get that far? It seems impossible now. What a Super F. We'll call him Frank. Uh, 
and the jump is very good. But how is the gravity looking? The speed was sensational, but unfavorable. He gets an F. Up next is three letters, G-U-N. It's a gun. Pew. And it doesn't even have legs. I don't know how it's moving, but the glide is very nice. Will it make it? Will we have J versus gun? No, we won't. What about the cab? C-A-B. Another three letters. The gun did quite well. How will the cab do? Nice jump, but no glide. Punched O forward a little though. Cabo. And now the van. It's got a bunch of letters inside. Don't know if that makes it heavier. Well, it seems like maybe. Yep, it's pretty heavy. It swallowed F, which leaves only... <laughs> Titan Z. And as you can see, well, he's he's a bit too big for the bridge. So I'm gonna have to shrink him down. Shrink my pretty. You gotta be smaller than the road. Nice. Now strap in, lads, because this could get spicy. Oh my goodness. Uh, wait. Oh, he's only, he only just got there. J versus Titan Z. We need a rematch. And this time from the back. We'll have to shrink him again. Why is he doing that face? Does this hurt? And J, you can go first. You gotta jump from this line. No cheating. And of course he won't because I'll be inside. Uh, yeah, yeet. How is it? J? Oh god. I think he just got lucky before. Oh, what's happened to my arm? Anyway, uh, Z, your turn, lad. Jump on the green. Hang on. Oh, no, he's just going. He's got he's got all the gravity on his side. He is a god after all. He can do what he wants. Is he? Are you serious? Are you? All right. Um, I think we have a winner. And it's the P that's stuck in the roof. Just kidding. My arm. It's Titan Z. Honorable mentions go to J, L, M, D, and F. So if you've enjoyed this video and you want to see more anti-gravity jump challenges, smash that like button and subscribe if you're new. Piss free and I'm yellow. So here's how it's gonna work. We're gonna have 10 rounds of a free-for-all, a battle royale. Some fellas might go down the hole, some may be eaten by air, but whoever wins each round gets a single point, and whoever has the most points at the end wins. And the battle has commenced. I think Q is dead, P is dead, O is dead. Uh, F's over there are giving the G-ish good shaking. V and W are fighting. I think N has, is N still? No, N's dead. K's over there getting shot by I. M just died, F is still going. W's just run over. Oh, there's a lot of dead bodies over here. Is V okay? I, I don't think so. V, F versus L, who will win? Come on, L, you've got this. No. No, he doesn't. F, F win. <laughs> there you have it. The first winner, the letter F. But we're going to change the positioning and maybe he won't have such an easy time. Also, what? Are you okay? All right, he's still alive. Reset round two. So now that we're all set up for round two, with F stood in the middle, where the winner of each previous round will have to start the next. Let's see if we get a new winner. Also, comment below which letter you think is going to win for each round. No cheating. Uh, let the battle commence. F has, uh, is he gonna fall down the hole? No, he's just gone straight for A. Uh-oh, uh, X is over here cloning himself though. This is going well. Uh, who's gone down the hole? Someone just went, who is it? Was it X? F's still winning, he just killed R. Now he's fighting Q. Oh my God, Q. He just killed Z. Uh-oh, oh, he's coming for more, he's coming for X. Is he winning? Are you winning, son? Come on, X, don't fight yourselves. Oh, I, I, an S, SBI. Now he's, who's he fighting? What's going on? He just killed E. Here comes S. Wait, he just killed F. No way. X versus S. And S wins. Are you, what? Oh, I thought he was going to jump down the hole. You want to go down the hole? You can go down the hole. There you have it. Your, your second winner, the worm. For round three, I've just sort of stuck him in a line. Uh, don't ask me why. Just thought it'd be fun. But of course, we do need to make room. Excuse me, gentlemen. Out of the way. Because S needs to go in the middle. Them's the rules. Now let the battle commence. Ding, ding. Make sure you vote. What is going on up there? What is happening up? Who's dying so fast? What is going on? I'm so confused. F's fighting D. I is killing H. G is, uh, who is he fighting? Oh, I just got hit in the hole. Where S was waiting for him. Oh, no. Oh, that's a snake bit if ever I've seen one. Z is fighting G. There's a lot of dead bodies. Q's dead. W's dead. V. A, M, Z is gone. Uh, where is he going? S is still, he's hiding. He's being sneaky. He's a sneaky snake. <laughs> They've been defeated by a wall. That's fine. We can, we can move you away from the wall. Get away from the wall. Oh, he's come for Z instead. Z, you want to you wanna come out? You stuck? Here he comes. Oh, and uh-oh. Uh-oh, he's just being picked up. F, I think he killed him. But now he's got to go down and kill the snake. He's not, he can't quite figure out. Maybe he doesn't want to go down. F's in the chats, lads. We're putting him in. Oh, there he goes. There he goes. Gone straight for him. Oh, S is doing a thing. S, S. Oh, S is dead. 
F wins. That's two wins for F. Oh, let's play soon. For round four of our battle royale, we have the first half of the alphabet on that side of the arena and the other half on this side. It's an even split. Now let's see who wins. My guess is that F's gonna kill everyone over that side. S will kill everyone over here. Or maybe X. No, S is dead. I think X got him. Uh-oh, that's a lot of X. Uh, F, how you doing over there? He's getting... Oh, he's surrounded. Oh, this could be it. This could be the moment. I think X just died? What? There's, there's nobody left on that side of the alphabet. I'm so confused. K and A, though. Uh-oh, F's still alive. He, he munched through all of them. A just jumped down the hole. F is fighting H. Is he, is he winning? Is it Scott? Are you winning? No, he's dead. He's still got him in his mouth. Oh, he's gone down straight down. He's just killed Y. Wait, no, he hasn't. Y must have killed A. Y versus F. Come on, Y. You've got this, lad. You've got this, you big marshmallow. Oh, no, he's dead. Third win for F. So for round number five, I've put the letters of the alphabet who haven't been doing great in their own little corner so they can have a little battle royale. Meanwhile, the four strongest can fight each other in the middle. And then we got another batch of weaklings. Will this change the outcome? I don't know. But let's find out. Ding, ding. Uh, who's doing all the flying around shooting and things? Is that X? X is... Uh, he's killing S. F just jumped down the pit. Uh, there's a cab over there. Um... C, A, and B seem to have combined to become a very strong creature. Get get out there. Go on. Go drive home for things. Oh, he's fighting Z? Is it Z? Is anyone down the hole? Uh, I think that's X. Y is over there. So it's Cab versus Y. I, I don't even know what happened to F. To be honest. Oh, he's just ran over. Oh, my God. Is he, did he win? Is that it? I'm pretty sure the cab won. I think so. Uh, okay. So for round number six, in the middle is cab, the winners of the last round, but we got some extra gear. It's the supers. We got super L, super M, super F, who's got all of the punctuation. And spread around, we got N, this O, super P, and super P. Now this is gonna be a battle. Who will win? Place your bets in the comments. And we begin. M's over there munching. O's dead, D's dead, P, everyone's dying so fast. R just got yeeted out. What the? What's happening? He just took him out of the, uh, the arena. There's a lot of F's over there. A lot of X's. Uh, I can't tell who's winning. There's so much going on. N and O are over here. He's been lightning bolted. Uh, what the? Yeah. M, O, N, and N. And um, M's dead. What? I, o is dead. I think N won? What? When were you the strongest? Had anyone voted for Super N? Because <laughs> if you did... Wow, he actually won. I didn't see that one coming. Round number seven. So for round number seven, we got the regular alphabet over here. All 26 letters. And on the other side, all the supers, including this time the cab, the gun, and the van, which has four letters in it. So whoever wins from this side, We'll have to fight the winner from this side. Place your bet. Can he do it again? Let the battle commence. Oh, there's a lot of fire. Oh, some of them are trying to escape. I can't tell what's happening. Super P is cornered. There's an A behind bars. The van's just exploded. M's still alive. Where's he going? Are you going in there? You going in? Uh, guys. <laughs> All right, we'll come back to that. That's fine. F has just murdered absolutely everyone. And now he's coming for M. Oh, M, sir. You do want to? You want to fight? Oh, that's it. You teach him a lesson. Oh, I think he's dead. He's he's got him. Now, M, you going in there? You're just spinning like a like a dog. What? <laughs> What's going on? Guys, you want to separate? There it is. Okay. M, M killed O. And then O killed, would die to M. I, I don't know. M wins. It's a bit of a mess, but I'm pretty sure. But the red rhino is this M. Round eight. So for round number eight, we've got the regular alphabet all over in this corner. And you're thinking, wait, where are the other ones? Well, I've put them all in the pit where they belong. Whoever makes it out of the pit can, can survive and get to fight the, the winner of whoever that'll be. Also, what's wrong with you? Ow! What just happened? What does that do? Anyway, back to the arena. Let the battle commence. And O is just... Oh, there's a lot of balls going on down there. A, a P it doesn't seem like she's doing much. Neither is F. I assume F over there is winning. He usually does. Is anyone dead down here? Uh, Super M has been killed. Uh, he's, uh, L is, being, is shooting F, I think. Something's going on. Wh who's winning over there? Is it X? X, you winning, son? Or is F winning again? Wait, F's been killed. Excellent. X wins. X is X going to give it to you. X has gone straight in. Oh, and he's kicking F. Uh-oh. Oh, F. Oh, he just breathed on him. Oh he, oh, he turned him into a fart and he's killed him. Now, a Super L. Ah! What happened? I'm dead. 
Uh, that's a spiky pit. Uh, P is still alive. L is now shooting N in the side of the head. You're gonna move N. You want you want to move around? P, you can move around as well. Let me. Uh, maybe they were stuck. Oh, now they're moving. No, no. I, I think N died. Now L is just shooting P in the face. She's stuck. Oh, someone help! Someone help that man! Oh my! Oh, he finally got it. We saw it, ladies and gentlemen. Let me get him out. Let me. There he is. Oh, your winner, Super L. Isn't he handsome? Look at his butt. So for round number nine, I think I've lost my mind and I've spawned in uh, five of each letter from the regular alphabet. And uh, I, I don't know how this is going to go. It may crash my entire game, but uh, the, these things have to be tested. Good luck, everyone. That is a slideshow. There's a lot of death. Um, I think there may be about a million X's over there. Fine. The more that die, the, the more frames I get back. Finally have some frames left. Look at all those bodies. The X just got killed by K. We've not seen that before. Uh, uh, M just died to L. W's over here. There's a lot of F's over there. Oh, no. There's still a gang of F's. There's one K. He's, um, uh, he's struggling. We'll help him out. We'll help him out. Come on. No, I dropped him down the hole. Okay, I'm so sorry. Get, I got you. I got you, pal. The F's are fighting each other. Okay, you've got this. They've been weakened. Use that flappy little arm. Never mind, he's dead. Did F win? A lot of death. Just death. I don't think we had a winner, but you know what? If it was anyone, I think it was Q. Let me know what you think. I, oh, he's just, he deserves a win. Look at him. Now for our 10th and final round. What did I do? He just, he burst like a balloon. Uh, clean up on aisle sand. So for the 10th round of the Alphabet Lord Battle Royale, we've got all the winners from each round. We started with an F, then we had an S, then an F, then another F, then the cap one, then it was Super N, Super M, Super L, and Q. And we're gonna find out who is the winner of the winners. Place your bet. My money's on Q. Uh-oh, oh no. Maybe if it hadn't been grabbed by F immediately. What's going on? The cab is running someone over. L is flying away. One of the Fs is dead. The S and the snake. The snake just beat the cab. Uh, N and M seem to be holding to each other from the stands. Anyway, L is fighting F. Come on, Super L, you've got this. Teach him a lesson. He's just a regular F. He ain't no special F. Lasers, lasers, more lasers. Come on, there it is, and he's got him. He's got him, and he's going for another one. Oh, this one's diff this one's murdering the C, and the, the snake seems to have lost to the A. C just died, and so did the F. I think this A might be stuck in this wall. There he is. We've released him. Oh, he's going for Super L. Oh, surely this. Well, although L might be weak, he's flying around. He's running from him. Uh, he's kind of got stuck in the wall. What are you doing? Hello? What is going on over there? Um, who are you even fighting? Are you winning, son? He's dead. Oh, there was an invisible Q. Q and invisible button. Huh? L seems to be going for something over here. Wait, is there someone in the wall? Oh, there's a B in the wall. Oh, never mind. He was killed. Uh, the, the lasers actually got through the wall. Now he's fighting N. He's been hit by those magic orbs. He's flying and he's dead. Oh, L was doing so much work. And now we just need to bring M back into the arena. This is while he was sort of stuck. Oh, and he's gone in. He's gone in. It's N versus M, and M wins. He's, oh, oh dear. Oh no, he's fallen. Oh, oh, Timber, your winner, the Super M. Look at him. He's glowing. He's so handsome. If you guessed Super M would win, you're a genius. But I've got an extra round to come. My God, what have I done? So for our final round, we have all of the supers and the combines, all the regular letters. But what's different? Well, this is what's different. Uh, he's a big boy. Uh, he's kind of too big for the arena. But he deserves a chance. Who will win? Place your bet. It ain't gonna be me. Oh, wait, he did the thing. He did the... Is everyone dead? I, I think he... Oh, he set fire to the world. Oh, no. Oh, V, he's still, he's still kicking. He doesn't give up, that lad. Oh, and he almost made it to the middle. Anyone in the hole? No? Well, if you if you wondered why the Titan Z wasn't here, that that's why. EOP. But I hope you've enjoyed this battle royale. If you have, smash that like button and subscribe if you're new. It's free. And I'm yellow. Wondering what this video is all about? Here's an example. There's me name. And now I gotta fight it. Will I win? Oh, close one. And that would be a point for the letters. But that doesn't count. It was just a test. <laughs> Let's have mercy. So if a monster wins, they win a point for the monster team. And if the letters win, they win a point. And up versus Tom. And so we'll need. 
that seems tough. That's a lot of letters. That's six V one. Ah, my money's on the letters. Round one. Oh, good luck, Tom. You've got this lad. Oh, he's yeeted three off. He's separated them. Smart moves by the lad with the legs. And oh, hang on. He nearly yeeted the O off as well. He's, uh, actually, oh, he's dead. Wait. <laughs> um, they didn't even need the. The That's a point for the letters. How about specifically Cartoon Cat? It's only a 3v1. Uh, I'm sure he's fine. The cat seen worse. He's gone for the C. He's dead immediately. Oh, these letters are strong. Will any of the monsters be able to kill their own name? It's 2-0. Up next is everyone's favorite. Why am I here, Jerry? You're gonna die immediately. That's five letters, lad. <laughs> How long will he last? Jerry, really? That's 3 0. Up next is a monster from Dark Deception. Its name is Killjoy. Ah, it's technically seven letters versus three heads on a robot. Penny, Lucky, and Porky. Wait, what's your name? Hangry the Pig. <laughs> oh, good luck. You really never know. Someone's gonna win. I just shot Jay in the back of the head. Oh, no. Killjoy's dead. Wait. He did kill O, though. That's good. Get away from me. That's 4-0. Up next is a lad we haven't seen for a while. It's Gorefield. That sounds like a lot of letters. You know when these monsters were created, uh, they didn't really think through having long names. This is the longest one yet. This is nine letters. Uh -huh. <laughs> you never know. I bet he's wishing he got cat. Oh, God. It's just too much. Wait. Is F? F's fighting someone. Relax, dude. It's 5-0. We're going to have to start bringing out the big guns. I was going to go with regular SpongeBob, but forget it. It's too many letters. We need RoboBob. That may, that may be the stupidest name I've ever spawned in. Look at it. RoboBob. That's a lot of B's and O's. Uh, will he win? I honestly think he might. He's gone in with a karate chop. He's yeeted most of the O's and a B away. Two B's and an R. RoboBob. Are you serial right, Meow? <laughs> oh, no. It's six now. All right, no more messing around. King Kong has arrived. But that is a long name. King Kong is quite a pretty looking name. Now, I think this is where the tides start to turn. The big fellas have arrived. Get him, monkey. What'd he do? What's he? Is he stepping on him? You winning, lad? Your toes are bigger than them. He's killed them all. He killed them in the order of Ikinong. <laughs> Ikinong. Where is he? What's he doing? Oh, he just killed G. G was still alive all the way over there for some reason. But finally, the monsters won. Oh, your beaks come off. It's 6-1. Oh, um, next is one of the smallest monsters you'll see today. It's Poppy. Is she even a monster? Yes. Look at her eyes. Aha. Uh -huh. And we'll need. Why are there so many peas? There's an army of peas. Come on, Poppy. Sort them out. Teach them a lesson. She's cast magic on them. O's dead. P's dead. P's dead. Y's dead. The last P. Poppy wins. Why is Y dead? <laughs> look at that bee. Why do they all look so happy? He finally dead. Poppy wins. 6-2. The comeback's on. We saw Kong. Now we see Zilla. Godzilla from 2021 to be exact. And so we'll need Godzilla. We got no numbers, so this will have to do. Good luck, letters. You're going to need it. This is the first time we've seen D and Z. This is going to be brutal. Come on, Godzilla. Do the thing. Why is he? Oh, he's charging up. He's lighting up. Okay. He's going to blast them. He's going to give it to them. Unless they kill him in time. Wait, no. He's breathing on them. Are they too low, though? Are they below him? I don't think he's hitting them. Don't tell her you missed, lad. Uh, do something else. Stamp on him. Nice stomp. Oh, there it is. Glaudil. Glaudil. He wins. Oh, wait. Z's still alive. Z, are you winning, lad? Is he doing it? Is he going to... Is he gonna win? Uh-oh, here comes the tail. No, he's dead. Oh, booty. That's 6-3. God, he's cool. Up next is the Armored Titan. That's a lot of letters, but he's a big boy. And there it is. That is the most letters we've seen so far. Seven in Armored and five in Titan. That's 12 letters. Only haven't even got any clothes. Will he win? Good luck, everyone. Oh, he's gonna charge through him. Shoulder charge. He just, is he farting? He lost. That wasn't even close. Um, seven. 7-3. Seven, seven, That's a lot of letters. Oh, no. Up next is Hank. 3D Hank. And not only is Hank it almost impossible to kill, his name's only four letters. Four very handsome letters who work nicely together. But uh, this should be over in a jiffy. And Hank's gone in with his sword. Please, Hank, do not lose to letters. You, you, I just called you almost unkillable. He's still alive. He's getting kicked in the butt. Is he Is he winning? He's going for the H. Now for the A. Uh, they've surrounded him. He's gone for the K. He's using a lot of blocking, although A just kicked him in the butt. <laughs> that was kind of funny. 
Stop blocking. More slashing. He's killed N. No. My favorite. K is dead. Who's next? Looks like it'll be A and H. You got much left in you? No, he's, he's dead as well. Stay at this. Another win for the monsters. The 7-4. Up next, another four letters. Similar to Hank. It's Hulk. And it's kind of interesting how his letters pretty much match him in color. I, th I think this is the first time we've seen you. Not you, the letter you. Who will win? Hulk, you better not lose to some letters. You are the Hulk. Oh, he's got new clear immediately. Uh, and he killed him in order of his name. What a legend. <laughs> That's actually kind of impressive. Uh, I do think he took a lot of damage, though, which is why he went nuclear so fast. 7-5, they're doing it. Up next, it's me. It's a banana. But I'm very strong. Can you tell by my armor? Now, let me see if I can remember how to spell this. <laughs> It looks so good. Will I win? Look at my eyes. And stop calling them golf balls. They're not golf balls. They're eyeballs. Get, get at me. Oh, the so wait a second. I did so well. Did I did I get any of them? That was supposed to be the strongest version of me. Oh, no. It's 8-5. Up next on the chopping block is Choo Choo Charles. But we'll just use Charles. S has made a return to fight another train. And the name looks pretty cool. Uh, but I don't think it's going to win. But let's find out. Ding, ding. He's shot a blast at them. He's gone. He's gone thermonuclear already. All the letters are still alive, though, except for E. E is dead. Then S, then H, then A. L is the only one left, I believe. No C is alive. R is alive. And nobody's, nobody's alive. They're all dead. <laughs> it was like so sad when you died. Uh, Charles gets a point for his team. It's 8 6. Up next is one of the biggest monsters so far. It's the Misty Guest. That's a long name, but he's a big boy. The Misty Guest. Exactly 10 letters. I honestly think the letters might be able to win this one. He's not the strongest. He's just mass. But let's find out. They've gone straight for him. Is he going to do anything? Oh, he's stamping on them. Ah, it's so big. I can't really see what's happening down there. They've all seemed to pile together. They're working as a unit. Mark. Oh, he's just killed. Oh, you see, you, you'll kill him. He's killed them all. They, uh, they all kind of died at once in a really weird word order. Oh, God, the snake. But that means that it's seven to eight. The monsters have almost caught up. Our next monster for the chopping block is Pookman. Now, I know what you're thinking. How do you spell that? Well, Pookman versus his name. He kind of fits in with them. But will he win? Uh, will he? I don't know. He's doing a, he seems to be doing bits. He's biting. He's, he's doing some sort of special move. Unless maybe that's the letters. I think that might be N doing that. But wait. I Oh, I thought he got one. No, he's just keeled over. Stop kicking him, lads. He's already dead. Oh, don't play football with him. World Cup is 9-7. First to 10 wins. And oh, it's going to be close. Up next is one of the derpiest Godzilla monsters I have ever seen. His name? Tomato Kun. And you spell it just like that. It's a lot of A's. W w will he win? Look at his arms. Uh, this could be all over. If the letters win this, they get 10 points. Oh my gosh. Wait a second. I don't think they're winning this, lads. Holy moly he just bangs his neck on the ground oh and he spelled out numb and i think a lot of these letters are pretty numb which means it's nine to eight a weird neck hole our next monster the sky screamer we haven't seen this fella for a while but his name's long no not that kind of long sky screamer that's 11 letters but he is a big fella can he win i Maybe? Honestly, I don't know. Can they even reach him? Can he reach them? He's, uh, I, I, I think he's taking damage from somebody. Somebody's hurting him. You can see the orb hitting his belly. How are the letters doing? They're dogpiling. Smart, but the, all the R's are dead. Oh, God. Does it even spell anything? No, it's complete nonsense. M is still alive. I take it back. He's dead. Oh, what? He was holding me up, which means it's nine all the final round. And I don't know what possessed me to choose this for our final monster. I've chosen one of my favorite trolls. His name is Mystery Man. And that's exactly 10 letters. This is one troll. Can he win? This one's for all the biscuits. Place your bets in the comments, letters or monsters. And let the final battle commence. Oh, he's been surrounded. Really? He's, he's supposed to be a strong troll. Oh, the letters are OP. So there you have it. You never know what monster's going to be stronger than their own name. If you want to see me do another video like this, smack that like button and subscribe if you're new. It's free.
an eye. Oh, I think it's fine. Now, if you're wondering, what the devil's this yellow man talking about? Here's how it works. We got blue. Then we got B, L, and... And now we're going to find out if blue can be his own name. Let's find out. I have a feeling he might be. What? He came for me for a second. He just picked up you and started punching him. Bees ran away. He's scared. Come on, Blue. Oh, they surrounded him. Oh, no. He, he didn't get any of them. Oh, he's just folded over. Blue. Well, that's a point for the alphabet. Up next is green. And you know how this goes now. Alrighty, there's not a single green letter. But it's green. Now, can green be the first of the rainbow friends to be his own name? Will we see a single one do it? The E's, the N, the, the world killed him in the end, but I think it was N. Where are you going? It's too little to the alphabet. Up next is red. How'd you spell it? Simple. Come on, little reds, you've got this. Do it for the boys. He's just gone in with a headbutt. He ain't messing around. Oh, and he's immediately turned. He got killed quite quickly, but he's going in. Oh, Hulk mode. Is he still gonna... Please don't tell me. Oh, he killed D. He killed R. He killed E. Red is the first to win. Well, Big Red. It's 2-1. They've done it. Look at R. Look at the state of this dude. He's still happy. Why is he still happy? Up next is Orange. And here is his opponents. Unfortunately for Orange, his name is made of six letters. A's made his first appearance and R has been pretty much in every fight so far. Will Orange win? I really doubt it. He's gone in. He's surrounded. He's being kicked. He got headbutted by the E. He's dead already. It's 3-1 to the letters. Where are they going? Up next is the turn of Yellow. Alrighty, well, things that don't look much easier for Yellow, to be honest. Uh, that's another six letters. And we got some new ones. W here. And why? Good luck, you big spoon. God, he's gonna need it. Come on, lads, you've got this. Oh, this seems so unfair. He's just dead. He's so dead. 4-1. But up next is pink. I can see a romance blossoming. Would you look at this? What a band of misfits. Three letters we've not seen so far. The P, the I, and the K. And they're about to murder our friend. Oh, will they? I has just shot him, but I think he shot one of his own friends. Oh, pink's dead. Oh, no. 5-1. Up next is one of the strongest original rainbow friends. It's purple. And there's his name. That's, a, that's a, another six letters. Oh, God. Get, get him. Get him, lads. Oh, he's gone straight in. He's yeeting a lot of them away. He's doing a lot of damage. Oh, L just chewed on him. 6-1. But now things get a little more interesting. We've got Cyan. And there's his name. Oh, it's only four letters. That's, that's easy. You got this, little fella. I believe in you. Oh, God. He's just splooted. Oh, he's suffering. No. Put him out of his misery. I, I think I'm just making it worse. 7-1? Why? One of the newest creatures is Peach. And it's the first time we've seen the letter H. But it's not looking great for Peach. But if Big Red can do it, may maybe so can Peach. Oh, okay. Doing the... Oh, just screamed at someone. Come on. If you kill one letter, you win a prize. You win death. That's what you've won. Oh, Peach. 8-1. The Rainbow Friends seem a little bit handicapped. So instead... We're going to do it so that if they're the same color, they can fight for the same team. Starting with the yellow team. It's still six versus four, but now maybe they have a chance. Let's find out. They've all gone in. They've separated the letters. It's a good tactic. The 500k special, he's belly flopping. Someone's dead. Two yellows are dead. Don't you tell me these letters are still going to win. Are you joking? No, I'm joking. I won. Oh. So now let's see if Blue, as a spider, who I believe is a little stronger, can take out his name. Let the battle commence. Come on, Blue. They, they have surrounded him. He screamed at one. Oh, he de-aggroed them all. Smart move. Oh, he's killed one. He, he, no, he didn't. He died to the U. All right, that's it. All the blues. Also, it's 10-1. You know, surely, right? <laughs> surely. There's seven of them. They don't look that tough. Come on, lads. Teach them a lesson. All right, Nightmare Blues just picked up L. Oh, God, he made him bleed. But L's back. He's back from the dead. You is dead. Okay, letters are dying. This is good. They're finally doing it. The baby's fighting L. He's backflipping, kicking him. Oh, what's going on? L's the only one left. L for left alone. Lonely dead. Killed by a baby. All right, guys, you can leave him now. You've you, you mangled him. That's 10-2. 
the rainbows are coming back. Up next is all the orange lads. We've only got five of them. Baby orange, regular orange, nightmare orange, dark orange, spider orange. <coughs> and here are their opponents. Six of them versus five. This should be close. Get them lads. And the battles commence. For some reason, all the orange ran to the right. Oh, which orange am I talking about? How, how, do, how does anyone know? There's a baby crying. I don't like it. Uh, what's going on? The spider just went splat. The baby's still alive. So is the nightmare, but all the letters are still here. Wait, no, E is dead. I think E has been killed. Come on, Nightmare Orange, you've got this. He killed G. Only four more to go. He's breathing fire. This is good from Nightmare. He's doing well. He's getting pounded, though, and he's dead. He managed to take out two. Oh, my gosh. This is... This is a baby. This is, someone left a baby. What do I do with this? It's 11 too. Up next, we're going to test all of the purple. We've got the baby, the nightmare, the great, magenta, regular purple, and spider purple. And their opponents? It's the purple gang versus the purple gang. Who will win? It's, uh, what's going on? I just died. I died to something purple. Something purple's going on. Uh, I can't tell who's winning. It's a it's a bit of a mess. I'm trying to avoid the attacks. P is dead. U is dead. The spider has been killed. Look at you over there. Oh, God. What's happening? Rainbow friends are dying. The baby's still alive. The baby's screaming. L is left. R is still here. It's 2v2. It's just the baby versus R. No way. Come on, baby. You got this. Come on. They're just kicking each other. Ah, no. The baby. I was so close. It was, what happened here? They won again. That was the closest battle we've seen. But that makes it 12-2. Our biggest group so far, the pink. There's eight of them. We got two babies. Regular pink, female pink, peach, coral, nightmare pink, and spider pink. And their opponents, the toughest group you've ever seen. Who will win? Surely the pinks, right? But you never know. I does have a gun. Well, Carl just did it and peed himself. I think he's doing the thing. That uh, P is dead. P is very dead. I looks like he'll be next. He's be oh N was next. I is dead. K is dead. Oh, it wasn't even close. Uh, one of the babies is crying though. Did anyone die? There's four here and four there. Not a single pink died. They all pee. That makes it 12 to 3. They won by that much and I'd even forgotten to include the female nightmare pink. Sorry, you weren't even needed. But up next are the red. And we saw that just a single red could beat red. So let's pick the longest name they have. Maroon. This handsome devil. But I have a feeling that still won't be enough. So let's pick another name. How about Nightmare Maroon? The longest possible combination. I may have gone too far. And let's see who wins. It's the first time we've seen T. And uh, some other letters. A lot is going on. I can't even tell what's happening. There's a lot of dead letters, though. And the reds, they're really going. G just got picked up. Wait, wow, Maroon's still here. He's just yeeting through. I d did a single one die? I, I don't think so. I think regular red turned into a uh, big red. But that was about it, guys. What's happening here? That makes it 12-4. What a mess. Up next. <coughs> up next and looking for some revenge is green. And he's brought spider green, dark green, lime, the two babies, and nightmare green. And their lovely opponents are their longest name available, nightmare green. That's a lot of letters, but that's a lot of green. Who will win? Come on, rainbow friends. Oh my goodness, they've gone in. They are, I just got screamed at. There's so much going on. I think the spider's dead already. Uh, green's dead, lime's dead. Uh-oh. Nightmare is taking on about five at once, but there's a big old mess over here. It's just a baby versus like eight letters. Oh gosh, dude, come help the baby. Oh no, it might be too many letters. Uh, although, the, this baby's still alive and so is the Nightmare. Some of these letters could be weak. It looks like, it looks like they are. M got screamed at. Still going. Headbutted and dead. The baby surrounded with nice distraction. R is dead. T is dead. G. H is dead. A is dead. E is dead. No way. Wait, no, he's still here, and he's dead. I can't believe it. They, they, they actually won. Victory dance. There it is. Look at him go. That's 12 to 5. This one rainbow friend that I always forget about is the forgotten one. And I'm going to give him some friends, like the white, the black, brown, and Jerry. Because uh, he just seems to fit in. They're, they're a bit of a band of misfits, but they look good. And who are they fighting? Forgotten. That's what they'll be facing. It's eight letters. This is five lads. Who will win and come out on top? Place your bets in the comments. No cheat. And let's see who wins. Oh, no. Oh, I think they turned on Jerry. Jerry was immediately murdered. I think his mates killed him. The forgotten one. What's that? He's fighting F. F is F's first fight. Whoa. Oh, he's doing all right. He's killed E, T, R, O, and N. And F is the only one left. 
F is using T as a weapon. T is, oh, I think he killed him by using him as a weapon, but now F is dead as well. That's a final point for the Rainbow Friends. 12 to 6. Well, there you have it. Them some strong names. If you've enjoyed this video and you want to see another one like it, smack that like button and subscribe if you're new. It's free. And I'm Yellow.